Okay, guys, this is game number two between Dream Team and Shock Game Club. Shock Game Club won first um, game. So they will play Sentinel side this time. Let's see groups one more time really fast. They are fighting for second place. Second or third, actually. Third place. So whoever wins will get one point and then will have more chance to pass groups. So very important match. Let's see how it goes. Don't forget everybody to press the like, press the subscribe if you want to support Balthazar. If you want to support top one tournament, press the like, press the subscribe. It is very easy to do. It is free, no gold required, so do it. Amazing performance from Shock Game Club. They dominated really nicely. In the beginning they started slow, but once they reached level 6, it was like a steamroll. Like an avalanche. <laughs> How is my English so far? Yeah, great bro, great, really great. We have that Balkan, you know, accent. accent. Yeah. Yeah. You work with clients or you work alone? Alone, just alone. Oh. I, I don't like we working with other people oh. because uh, when it comes to money, uh, discussion always arise. What do you mean? Well, I mean, I'll, uh, I'll tell you about the pension system. The pension system goes like this. You go make a private pension and you get a mathematical algorithm for that, high risk, low risk. But in essence, that trader that makes the trades, if they are not made by uh, bots, does whatever he wants with your money. And when this happens, discussions always come into play. I don't like to, to complicate myself. Okay. I don't ask for much, it's enough to have a decent living. Yeah, I understand. Okay, we see first Ben Zeus from Shot Game Club. By the way, they will pick, they will pick actually second. I'm not sure why they banned this time Zeus, they picked it first and now they are banning it. Maybe they do not want to give this combo or something, I am not sure. Omni Knight banned one more time. Kunka will be picked, okay, cool. Shaker is there left. Do we see maybe, <laughs> do we see maybe Kunka and Storm combo? That will be interesting if we see that. Also, we could see Phoenix with Kunka. I love Phoenix and Kunka combo, really amazing. Tiny and Shaker, oh, I, that's strong. Yeah, they will hunt them down this game. They will... Two melee heroes there, so I think sh uh, Phoenix would be great to pick here. Clock is a good combo with Kunka. First kill of Kunka while you're in the box plus ship. Could be interesting. When you have ship there with Clockwork and that's really nice combo definitely also kunka ship will help you survive combo from tiny tiny combo is killing everybody basically and also it's really great to have strength heroes Ugna band 
Oh, Invoker. Invoker will be picked. Oh, I love it. It can be a good counter to clock if you if you put it like that. You get a sun strike for free. <laughs> it's... Yeah, good counter. Oh, first time Shredder, man. First time first we are going time. to see it. First time. Damn. Do you think we'll see Spectre again on Sentinel side? Well, very possible, man. We could see Spectra on both sides, even Skirt side. I mean, so far the the score side is based on the on the clock. Clock will initiate and Skyrat Mage and Kunka will follow. Skeleton will be played. Okay, they might ban Spectra. They do not want to play against this here, I believe. Late game Spectra will dominate Skeleton in any, in most of the case. Why, why did they pick Skeleton? I mean, you have Invoker, you have your mana burn. He has uh, stun, really he has aura, I'm not sure. Maybe because Tiny cannot kill him with Nuke, you know? It's not bad to have Skeleton against Tiny. Tiny is boring, like, when you're playing against him, he will kill you, and then you do, cannot farm, you cannot, like, do anything. And when you're playing Tiny, you do not want to jump on Skeleton. That's one thing, you do not want to kill this guy because he will respawn immediately, so... You will stay away from Skeleton. Maybe that's the plan here. Yeah, but Skeleton also needs a lot of farm. It's it's very weak. Before level 6, Skeleton is it's quite weak. I agree. Depends on laning phase, definitely. Most of the games, it is the most important how laning will go. Silence will be banned. The the Sentinel I'm team has a, an area, a, an all all map area style play. Invoker plus Tiny, Shaker plus Invoker, and you can jump with uh, with the the what's the name of the four hero, the Goblin. I'm not sure why why uh, Silencer is banned because. There is no carry on Sentinel side. They need something maybe for for fighting late game. Some physical yes, damage dealer. But Silencer falls very fast against Tiny and Shaker. Drops in two seconds. I think they could go for Sniper maybe. Sniper shooting from distance, not bad. Storm could be a very strong pick for Sentinel. But it gets countered by, by Skyrat Mage. I mean, it could be also Storm pick, why not? But I would say Sniper because of... Because of, like, physical damage. Okay, they are taking more time to ban. I think Phoenix should be banned. Phoenix is still an option for Scourge side, definitely. Oof, they are taking a lot of time to ban. Okay. Phoenix and Sniper last picks, my opinion. Let's see how it goes. Medusa would be a very strong pick. Furion, man. Very interesting, Ben. 
Yeah. Maybe they, they watched. Maybe they watched our first game commentary. We speak about Furion, so that's why he's banned. This is such an underrated uh, play, uh, hero in team plays. Which one? Furion. Yeah, he can create space. Oh, Mirana, oh. respect. Yeah, they, will, they will go for kills. This this will be a very interesting game. Actually, there is chance now for for Scourge side to win this game, I believe, because in late game they can catch up really quickly with these heroes. There is no hard uh, physical damage dealer in late game for Sentinel side. Tiny can deal damage, but that's not enough. So, I mean, combo with Tiny and Invoker, that physical damage bonus coming from Invoker on Tiny is insane. So that could be like one strategy for pushing towers. You want to buff your Tiny and then go slash the towers, slam, slam them. So, you know, if if maybe Tiny goes for fast, for fast uh, Agonis. Storm last pick. Yeah. So that means Skyrat will be support. Clockwork could go hard lane. Kunka and Sky could be support this game, yeah. Let's see. Very interesting pick on both sides. Which one do you like more? I find it interesting more the the Scorch pick this game. Because uh, both teams have, uh, have a huge initiation factor. Sentinel has Tiny and uh, Scorch has Clock. And Mirana, Sentinel side. And Mirana. Arrow. Mirana is the, the tricky hero because uh, you yeah. can use the ultimate instead of smoke. If they don't have wards, uh, uh, they don't have sentries. They can gank very fast. Sand King is not picked even once yet. Sand King is a it's a very strong counter to to Arachnid. You come with ten spiders and you you max uh, at level seven the third skill on Chrysalis, and you have three thousand damage from those spiders alone. It's insane damage. Yeah, I'm not sure why players are not playing Sand King. Probably because they are not really practicing this hero, so they do not want to risk. You know, if you don't play one hero for a while, then it could be a big mistake. Forces are under attack. You want to stick with heroes that you are familiar with, so that could be the reason. I'll yeah, that's why you, you always see the same, almost the same picks in, in tournaments. Oh, Fisher always oh, oh. already. Aggressive. Oh, toss. Nice. Okay, I don't know why. Clock attacked Invoker one time. He's wasting now a lot of time for Sentinel side. They are chasing the kill. Oh, he's a little bit blocking himself, man, with this run. Taking but, three players with him. Yeah, yeah, yeah but he can. Oh, another fish. I mean, he could maybe survive, but he took wrong path man if he went just forward like this from here and then to the rune that would be better the forward, escape even mid even go and gank the mid Oof. oh nice Storm. Storm. oh he will die yeah. did he hit the arrow or no I, I didn't see it i see it only when he had like one hit left okay actually no arrow skill he died on Starfall. A player's okay, bottle okay. coming on, on Mirana. <coughs> He's low HP, he should be careful definitely there. We see a rotation on mid against Storm. Oh, her. I'm telling you, man, he should be careful. Bottle is there, but... Oh. 
Oh my god, man, he survived. Wow. And Skyra died. What a play from Mirana there. Both teams went to count to gang mid, but uh, Mirana stole the show. And then you have a region uh, waiting for you in the river, man. That That's karma. That uh, karma always rewards the winners. <laughs> Torrent will <laughs> hit. Okay, now to top lane. Top lane is passive lane so far. Skeleton getting free farm. Bot lane in Walker okay. having free farm. They will go for mid again. Okay. Fisher. Tiny. Tiny already there. Fisher will hit. Yeah. Dead. Okay. Invoker actually got killed, man. Three heroes attacked and Invoker got lost hit. A player's forces are under attack. That, that's the power of... Uh, of heroes that hit all over the map. Oof, Mirana, look. Oh, what is this, brother? Oh, what is this? I do this also sometimes, man. I am baited from courier, I go for that courier kill. That courier gives a lot of gold in the beginning, but... Yeah, like 1000 gold almost for your team. But it is risky play, man. Mirana... We may see a, a gank on Tiny. No X. Tiny is just doing ganking, he's not farming or getting experience. Together with Shaker. A player's forces are under attack. Arrow okay. missed, but Yeah, but he should go down anyway. Yeah, start for Conca dead. This is perfect laning for Invoker, I have to say. He has free farm, free experience. This is the best situation for Invoker that you can get. Yes, and uh, they they uh, actually forced it. They forced it with Tiny and with uh, a Shaker. By playing games. They forced the support to rotate. I haven't seen very often uh, a creep equilibrium. For example, on top lane, Skyrath Mage could go only for denies and to keep the, the creeps close to your tower in order not to begin. Okay, X mark mid lane coming on Mirana, all of HP. There is level 6 on Storm. He should be ready to go for a kill. Nice play from Storm, taking kill and getting out. Fisher will miss Storm. If Mirana. If uh, Shaker got stun on Storm, that would be maybe a different story. He 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 was in a hurry to stun Storm. He didn't wait for Storm to to land. If he will have got the Fisher near the tower, we miss bot lane kill on Clockwork. Solo kill from Invoker. He has almost gold for Midas if he will buy it, I'm not sure. By the way, Invoker could be ganked right now. Kunkai and Storm incoming also. Invoker has vision there, so... Nice arrow from Mirana hitting Sky. Double kill there on top lane. Level 4 on Skeleton. Big problem, really. Oh, nice top lane arrow. Oh, 
Invoker Sunstrike is not there and now Shredder can he take a kill? No, oh my god, he's missing Sunstrike. Arrow will hard be to hit Arrow from this situation. He can go in whichever direction. He might die. Oh, yeah. nice play from Shredder, man. That was. He got close to the trees and Shredder used the, the second skill. Yeah, nice combo also to shut down. Oh, Tiny going for Clockwork now, fast kill. They will not be able to kill Kunka because everything is used. Oof, one hit. One hit on Kunka, man. A player's forces are under attack. A town is under siege. Yeah, they will go for mid. They know Storm is coming for rune. Kunka left it there. Okay. Tiny may actually die. Arrow will miss, Tiny will miss, and now Tiny will go down. Haste on Mirana. Yep, he will go down. There is no mana on Skyrod. A town is under siege. Clock going for kill on Shaker. Oh, do we see a stun strike? Nice oh, play. Link. Nice catch from Clockwork. A player's forces are under attack. Skeleton still level five. May die. Oh, level they are six. Going for him. Level 6, but he does not have mana, bro. He wasted mana on stun and now he's in trouble. Stun will connect and toss another one. Nice. If he didn't use stun, he would survive. Yep. A player's forces are under attack. A town is under siege. Tiny not even farming, going for heroes, searching the forest. Yeah, he has arcane, which is not bad. A player's force he has arcane. Attack. He can help his team now with mana. With, he can help with toss tiny, with toss shaker. Really. I'm smoking, smoke on both. Both team are searching for for each other. Yeah, can you imagine if? Skyrat and Storm waiting in, in jungle, in their jungle for kills for this counter ganks. That would be really pro play. Yep. A player's forces are under attack. Those uh, smoke ganks are really interesting because uh, you get usually one team on one side and the, if the teams meet you get uh, a nice combo, but if they chase each other on the wrong side of the map, it's... Uh... <laughs> okay, great. Uh, now bot lane gank is coming on Invoker. Can they take a kill fast? X, X is coming. Oh, Torrent will hit. Skyrot with Silent. But ulti from Mirana saving Invoker. Oh my god, man. No mana on no, X will connect. Torrent will not connect. That was close. But Storm will go for Shaker actually. Storm oh, died to Oh my Great god, back. he almost died. But Goblin does not have mana. Her shaker die from rocket from clock. Very nice play from clock. I missed it. Nice arrow. Tiny coming right now for. I don't know why Sky is there standing. Wait, Storm died. A player's force is Sounds like attack. from Invoker, I think, killed.
player's forces are under attack. Those fed kills are, are tricky in a way because they give free farm to Skeleton. Yeah, but he is not having arm at 13 minutes already, which is not looking good. He, he just finished it. He will, he will buy now the, the last piece. Initiation on Tiny on bot lane. Tiny is going down. Oh, really fast. <laughs> Sun Strike will finish the kill on Clockwork. 3000 gold on Invoker, man. He's not buying item yet. Maybe he's going for Agony, straight Agony. I know, but why not buying items? He's a really squishy hero with 900 HP, he could die. The player's forces are under attack. Mirana ulti. Mirana ulti initiation on top lane. Oh my god, where is his ulti, man? Yeah, he killed him. Monka died as well. Great ulti from Mirana. Storm I get tiny on mid. A player's forces are under attack. The town is under siege. Storm got the tower, Storm will, will uh, have point booster, 1000 gold. Well, so far Storm could maybe come back this game if he can find farm. Players forces are under attack. Oh, top lane, X on Mirana. Oh, he missed, ship hit, and now Storm, Storm took a kill. Oh, Shredder is here, man. He's going for a kill on. Oh my I god! I left my forest. Nice play from Storm. Great job. Double kill is there. Tiny finding Kunka. Two more hits will need. Oh, Boots. Where is Boots? Kunka. Another kill. Triple kill. For Tiny. They have the tower here, the tower. He has gold for Blink. Blink is flying right now and even Tiny will be now scary, man. Scary dude. Tiny is the, the hero that I, I hate the most when I see it on the other <laughs> team. Man, when, he, when Tiny starts nuking, Clock tried to deny the tower on bottom. When, when Tiny starts nuking, it's, it's insane. And you can make the hero carry. You can put an Aghanim on him, you can put a Manta style and... It, it's... I really hate Tiny, man. <laughs> Arrow on Clock hitting on oh, Clock. On look point. at this combo, man. Soundstrike, Starfall, everything. Oh, Tiny was baited. What skeleton now in trouble, man? Can he survive? Torrent will hit. Oh, where is ship? Too late, ship coming. Oh, double! Tiny. Double. Tiny is living. Storm is coming. Storm, storm is coming. Nice play yeah, from Storm. Big kill. Yeah, but they took a, a tower on top. On, on bottom, I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah, second tower. It's a good trade.
Mirana with armlet, okay. A player's forces are under attack. I think Mirana should get Yul's capture because Kunka is really annoying. Yes, they could. It, it would give more uh, survivability. Definitely. Also, silence maybe against Storm would be nice. A player's forces are under attack. Armlet is just for joking, I would say. Actually, it's he can... It's a good item tricky against Kai. I... Armlet is a very tricky Shuffle. item because if you play it right, you survive in a lot of bad situations. Yeah. Oof, clock missing ulti. A town is under siege. A player's forces are under attack. Arrow missing. Nice jump from Tiny. Storm staying alive, barely, man. Sunstrike could connect also, almost. Nice kill from Storm. Perfect play, beautiful. Look at that Invoker, how fat he is, man. The town is under Playing Aghanim. When he reaches level 17, he will... He will come into play really hard. Oh, X mark from Kunka. No, he will miss combo. Oh my gosh. Arrow will hit clock and Tiny. Clock will fall. Can Storm get the kill? Oh. Player's forces are under attack. Next target is Mirana. Oh yeah. Oof, nice try from back arrow. X mark with torrent will hit. Stun from will hit and he should go down. Yep. Skeleton now. Mirana survived thanks to the armlet. Oh, do we see another kill on storm? Almost. Sun strike no, almost no. connected. There is no mana on storm. Oh, what did he do, man? There is no mana on Skeleton. Oh, critical, lucky critical. Storm died. I am not sure why did he go like that, man. He should stay alive in this point of the game because it could be comeback, man. It could be comeback. Shaker does not have blink. It's quite hard to make decisions like that because uh, when you start rolling... Top lane. Top lane. Oh my god. He X mark on Storm. Oh, one more. Nope. No man on Storm. Invoker will live. Oh, what a misplay from Konka now. Tiny got kill. Man, Tiny. this... Shaker died, I think, yeah. This play on Mirana, he arrowed and leaped forward, but the arrow missed on top. I actually get Kunka. Kunka is so low, no items. Walker died from Storm, by the way. A player's forces are under attack. Top lane. Oh my god. Look at this, this armlet, <laughs> man. This armlet play. Oh my god, man. What a play with armlet. That's why armlet is there. Very strong item in the right hands. First first time I saw armlet played really well, it was... I don't know, a YouTube channel, Astro Boy or something. Yeah. That man stayed on the tower, was taking hits and was hitting the tower. Just with armlet and 1 HP. First time I saw it, I was really impressed. Amazing item, really. Yeah, but you, I... 
I'm uh, I'm quite a noob at this game, even though I, I love the game. Every time I pick armlet, I I forgot to turn it on and off, and I die from lack of HP. And you need like good concentration for this. I know when I'm tired, it's really hard for me to turn on and turn off armlet in the right time. You must be like concentrated well, and you have to be focused like if you want to do it right. We may see a gank in the Sentinel Forest. Mid lane. Warden. Oh, double ship, ulti from Storm, and now Shredder will fall like a bird. Earthshaker might be in danger. No. No, they are not going. They oh, come back. Sky is actually dead. Sky, sure. it's second or third time he, he, he played it. Uh, Wrong. He he goes all the all over the map, doesn't stay with the team and gets ganked. He died six times so far. Clockwork died more times because Invoker is really good counter to Clockwork. Once he yeah, but jumps, clock is, it's always initiating. Clock is always in the middle of the fight. Okay, Storm going for a kill on Shaker. Nice play. Tiny is big problem here against Storm. So that's why Storm must be careful. I think comeback could happen here for Storm Spirit because he's getting fat really. Look at this. Charge and going for silence. Oh, even now he got killed. They saw Mirana with sentry ward. Mirana could be in trouble if... Oh, oh! Nice dodge man. And now Storm... We'll go back. Close. That was close, Arrow. Invoker just farming. Are under attack. Skeleton King got farmed in, in, uh, in this time. Got blink. Nice silence from Sky and now ult. X mark. Oof. Ship will miss Mirana, but Shredder got caught. Nice jump from Storm one more time, and Shredder is dead. Even Shaker is now dead. And this is the sign of comeback right now, right there. Invoker should start joining fights. He's only farming, split pushing. It is not going well for his team. Okay, now even Invoker will be caught here. No X mark. X mark is coming. Mana burn was perfect for Storm and now there is no mana on Storm. Okay, stun will be enough from Skeleton to take it. Kunkka died as well. 15 charges on Bloodstone. Doesn't join the fights, we may see a third game. Are under attack. Blink on Mirana, this hero man, you will not catch it. Okay, oof, that was close. Close on Skeleton King. Skeleton level 16, now he has ulti more often, which means that could be very useful in fights. Unless Invoker burns mana and then you are in trouble. Clock with level 11, he can go for hook. Smoke is there ready to be... I mean to help, let's see. Oh damn! Stun is coming. Slow oh clock got stunned. Now Mirana going in. Nice torrent and ship will hit actually Shredder. Shredder is going down. Mirana X mark nice stun now from Oh Tiny not killing Skyrat. Very big play. And now Mirana is dead. Invoker is coming a little bit late. So Meteor missing everybody. Good fight for now. For Dream Team. Can they come back from this? Storm getting a region now. Oof, this is looking very well now for for Dream Team. They can go now and take more kills if they like. They have region, they have everything what they need. They silence and tiny, yep. Yeah. Yeah. Look at this now. Okay. He's just baiting. Storm is just baiting a little bit spells now. He can region. 
Actually, third skill save, Tiny. Nice jump from Storm and Tiny will go down. Oh my god, he survived. Nice play from Clock, he killed the Invoker. Shaker will be dead as well. That's a lot of gold for Storm Spirit, a lot of charges, almost 20 men. It will be even harder now to stop Storm from pl from uh, flying. All Storm needs right now is uh, Blacking Bar, Avatar. A and it's forces are under set. Attack. You think he will go for BKB? I don't know, let's see. It would be the most logical choice. Yeah. Because they have a lot of runners. They have Tiny, they have Warshaker. Yeah, all magic damage Invo is coming from Sentinel. A rush attempt. I believe they can kill him before even somebody shows because they have a lot of power right now, if, especially with Storm. And they have sentries all over the map, they can see the sentinel. Even with, uh, only with smoke, they cannot see them. Shaker does not have any gold, also Blink is not there, so he cannot jump in. Storm now with Aegis, man. How do you kill this hero two times? Storm jumping immediately on Invoker, he does not have Yul's Captor. And he's dead there. Without Yul's Captor, you cannot survive Storm. Perfect play, beautiful kill. We may see a trade of towers. Top lane, Mirana trying to push. By the way, Mirana with travel now. Clock keeping top lane. They want to defend actually. They do not want to keep pushing. Oh, okay, Mirana in trouble. I mean, Mirana is dead, not in trouble, man. X mark one more time on Storm, okay? Kunka should ca be careful with this X mark. A player's forces are Oof, tiny jumping on Storm. There is not enough damage anymore to kill. To kill Storm and now Tiny will fall like a bird. Pirate Mage out of position again. Actually, he's, he did great job actually. He silenced Shredder, man. He took a kill. Almost, by the way. He denied himself and now look at Shaker falling. Man, Skeleton hitting hard at this moment. Burn mana is coming. Okay, this could be dangerous for Skeleton. He has enough mana for, for his pound. There is perfect sentry board, stun will hit, but no mana on Skeleton now. But the Storm is there. Here. Yeah, this is now a lot... A lot of big advantage. Big advantage for Skur side, they have a lot of farm. A lot of items. Hex is there for Storm with Aegis. Man, even Skeleton is fat. 4000 gold. I don't see comeback now coming from... Sentinel, it will be very difficult for them. They do not have any strong hitters. How do you bring down, for example, Storm? You cannot do it. Very hard, yeah. Hex on Storm, not a, not a Blacking Bar. Yeah. Mirana now with smoke, trying to search for somebody. Okay, Rocket will miss. Oh, maybe they saw them coming because Sentry was there. Everything is pink on the minimap. Everything is lighted. The score sees everything. Even on top lane. Oh, this could be maybe the momentum for... Okay, Kunka will fall. Nice play. Tiny man dying so fast. Nice save. Nice save. And now Clock is also dead. Nice double kill, okay, they, okay, they have something here, man. Skeleton now solo here versus five heroes. Invoker is also coming with mana burn, and now 
he's dead once, they must kill him one more time. Storm is coming from top. He just took an arrow to the face. Damn. Just took an arrow to the face, could not jump. I'm not sure why Storm is not aggressive at this moment. Nobody can stop him. Okay, <laughs> I was speaking about this. <laughs> Yeah, but one versus five is, is quite tricky. Yeah, look, but he's doing everything great, man. Look at this. With Aegis, he can do this. Nice play. He can go for more. He's going. Man, he's full of mana, bro. Buyback from Invoker. Mana burn. Okay, now, now should be a time to retrieve. Because of buyback. Okay, Mirana is coming. Nope. No, denied by Storm. Nice play, nice play from Storm. Oh, he's chasing more. Now he will go back. Skeleton playing here with Armet, man. X mark with Torrent is coming. It will connect. Low, low HP. Kunka will die. Low HP on Mirana. Oh, yeah. They pushed going. too much. Nice hex. Shaker is there. We're waiting for stun. Shaker getting closer to blink now with this fight. Clock should use blade mail. Okay. He did. Ulti from Mirana just came. Mirana oh. can actually drop it. Back for the Sentinel. Mid lane. Oh, they're retreating. Storm initiating. Oh, oh man. my god. Stun will he take and can finally kill a storm. Oh my god, he tossed him. And he, he actually <laughs> came to here. <laughs> oh my god, man. Did you see? He tossed him right, be right there, man. Yes. Yes. He respawned so fast that he came on same place. Oh Game my! I think the I didn't see this before. This could be a war Dota moment. Yeah. Have you, have you thought of having a, a guy who is good at editing videos? You have a lot of. You this? can make a lot of videos on YouTube, for example. It's trending right now. Strong hero, really strong hero, and it. This is uh, actually mid rex I think. Let's see if they can take fast mid rex before Invoker start. Okay, hex on Invoker, stun on Invoker, and another kill on Invoker. Irana will go down too. Maybe let's see. Yeah. Nope. Armored. Thanks to the armored, he will survive. Rex destroyed. They are going for bot too. I don't think this is a smart move actually. Everybody alive almost. Invoker almost. I mean only Invoker is dead. Okay, Kunka will fall. Clockwork even in trouble. Okay, he will go back. They do have a goal for buyback. Clock and, uh, and Skeleton have goal for buyback. They have a lot of gold. Storm doesn't even need to buy back, he has 23 charges. He will respawn in, in 5 seconds, I think. A town is under siege. So far this it is... Ward, yeah? This war here made it possible. Those gangs here under the tower in the middle, in the forest. Yeah, definitely. This kind of aggressive wards changing the game. Sentinel haven't pushed any tower on mid lane. They, they are kind of forced to go mid lane. Storm is ganking again. I didn't see what happened. 
he ganged under the, the ward and make the blacking bar good luck killing him now you you cannot kill storm players forces are under attack oh tiny got shipped to the base invoker yep. even invoker man that skeleton king got fed too much it's so hard right now Under siege. A player's forces are under attack. Okay. Initiating again. Nice silence in Mirana. And uh, Mirana got caught in the middle, leap just in the middle of them. Oh, X Mark is there. Caught and everything. Nice play from from uh, Dream Team. They're doing great job, and now this will be. Yeah, we'll see a game number three. A player's forces are under attack. I don't know why they didn't defend one more time. It would be entertaining for for viewers to see one more defense from Invoker and from his team. One more fight would be really great. I believe I believe because you cannot kill skeleton at this point because there is no carry in team. They but would just uh, feed them kills at this point. But I mean, still they could go for one more fight just for entertaining. For entertaining, yes. But uh, it would be bad for morale. They took their loss and... Yeah. You can't pick. So. Yeah, yeah, no chance even skeleton with BKB exactly. now. Oh. It is really, really definitely. This means game number three, guys. 1-1. One, one. Unbelievable. This is actually second time on tournament we are watching third game. Really nice play from both teams. This, the, this time uh, Dream Team won. So that means 1-1. One, one. As you can see on score right now, it is 1-1, one, one, guys. 26 kills Storm. Amazing play. Amazing play from Storm Spirit, yeah. They will need to roll for a side now.